Hey guys, this is Dr. Herb. In case you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe for updates. Let's look at the leukocyte function and the defects. So the defects in the leukocyte leukocyte function. So what are the defects in the leukocyte function? The first one being the leukocyte. First is the leukocyte addition. So by the leukocyte addition, what do we have? Leukocyte addition, it includes the first one, the leukocyte addition one. So this includes the mutation of the beta chains. So it is a, new, a beta chains of the CD11. So beta chains of CD11 as well as the 18 integrins. So this is what is involved. Then the LAD, LAD2, that is the leukocyte addition deficiency 2. This involves the mutations. Again, the mutations in the FUCO. This is the FUCO sign. This is the FUCO sign transferase. So fugacyl transferase is involved. This is in the LAD2. Then the Ched Chediak-Higashi syndrome, CHS. So this is the decreased leukocyte functions because of the mutations affecting the protein. The mutations, it affect the protein. The mutations affect the protein involved in the LYST. LYST stands for the lysosomal membrane traffic then the chronic granulomatous disease it is a defect in the gene encoding for the phago there is phago site so there is a phagocyte oxidase phagocyte oxidase is what is involved then we move on to the myeloperoxidase so myeloperoxidase deficiency this involves a decrease in the microbial killing because of the defective mpo h2o2 system so there's a defective mpo and uh, H2O2 system. To learn and grow daily like this, please do subscribe.